English football icon David Beckham announced plans to establish a major league soccer team in Miami four years ago. He struggled to get the dream off the ground, but finally, his efforts may be bearing fruit. On Monday, Beckham announced his dream had come true after MLS granted him an expansion franchise. CNN's Don Riddell has been speaking with Beckham. Don, that's quite a get. What did Mr. Beckham have to say? Well, he had a lot to say, and he was very, very emotional about this. Of course, football fans know that you have to wait four years for a World Cup to come around, but you know that it will come around. The situation with Miami and the franchise these guys were pursuing is that it almost went away. And in fact, they were saying that as recently as just two months ago, they were ready to walk away from this because it just wasn't working out. They had problems finding a location for the stadium. There was problems with the investment team, but they were absolutely determined and finally got there today, becoming the 25th franchise in Major League Soccer. And Beckham admitted that it was a very emotional day for him personally. And I asked him about that. I just think it's been a long journey. It's been long, tiring, hard at times, great at times. Um, and at times we didn't think it was going to happen. So being on stage today, being awarded the franchise officially by Don, the commissioner, um, having my partners and owners up on stage, having our family in the audience, having the fans, it's real and it's happening. And um, it's been it's been an emotional journey but one that uh, i look back on now and there's a reason it's taken this long there's a reason why you know we've uh, met different owners and it didn't work out and different investors because it just wasn't right and now it's right so so, of course, David Beckham, uh, a very famous and successful football player. He is also a brand, a global icon, and now he is a football team owner. They can't wait to get started for real. Uh, he is a jack of many trades. Um, and Don, I wonder what is left to do when it comes to actually seeing this Miami team play and get off the ground? Uh, well, there's a lot of work still to be done. Of course, they've now got to build the stadium and they've got to recruit a team. David Beckham also says he's going to be building an academy because they don't just want to be luring some of the better players from around the world, but they also want to build uh, a team from the grassroots up and have a football team that really does represent the community. But, of course, this is all going to take a number of years. What we're being told today is that the new Miami team, and we don't know exactly what they're going to be called yet, that announcement will come in a couple of weeks' time, uh, they'll begin playing in the 2020 season they'll move into their new stadium in 2021 and of course it remains to be seen whether or not they'll be a success remember miami had a major league soccer team uh, called the miami fusion which didn't really work and they ended up going bust and dropped out of the league of course and so people are concerned that maybe miami was never the right place for it to work but mm -hmm. major league soccer is booming particularly in the southeast you've got already a team in orlando a team in atlanta which has been highly successful in their first year there's a team from nashville coming and now these guys in 2020 and if it wasn't going to work, how about having David Beckham as the figurehead of the club? That is certainly going to persuade a lot of people that they want to be involved with this. And he's shown us by sticking with this project that he's not a quitter and he is determined uh, to make a success well, of this. Well, maybe it'll be the shot in the arm that the sport finally uh, gets American soccer in America. The fact that I don't remember the Miami Fusion, though, shows what an uphill battle it is. All right, Don Riddell, thanks so much. And I know uh, viewers can see a lot more of your interview with David Beckham coming up on World Sport.